What's up everyone, hope you are all doing well as we are back with more New World. And in this video we are going to be covering speed leveling your skinning all the way up to level 200 to max it out in hopefully just a few hours. The key to this though is going to be to remember that whilst there are loads of animals that can be skinned in New World, not all of them are created equally. And actually, knowing both the type of creature and both their location of some of these key skinning spots can really catapult your skinning to 200 extremely quickly. In the low levels though, this is just going to be wolves. There is no real getting away from this. You can't start by skinning high level monsters as you won't actually have the skinning level to do it. And frankly, I'm going to assume that you probably won't have the character level to kill them anyway. I know this sounds like a little bit of a crap start to a guide by just saying, for level skinning, just skin stuff. <laughs> I know that sounds like a cop out, but in the early levels, that is honestly the easiest way. If you choose to power level this, then you're going to be sort of stuck on doing the wolves till around about level 70 skinning. But in reality, this should actually just happen naturally in the course of your early game grind as you're running through those main and the side quests. If you're skinning stuff as you go, as those quests take you through different areas, then you should realistically get to level 70 skinning fairly easily. Once you hit that skinning level 70 though, this is when you're going to be able to start to power things along a little bit more. And Cutlass Keys is going to be the best area for this. And you want to be targeting either the Lush Hunt Pointers that you'll find in the center of the map at Barbie Belt, or the Tropical Boars they also tend to sort of reside in the center of the map, more in the forests. Both of them are going to be giving you pretty similar levels of skinning experience. Although the boars do tend to give a little bit more weapon experience, but the lush hunt pointers tend to be slightly more concentrated, so you can kind of run and skin between them a little bit quicker. And honestly, you're going to be getting almost a skinning level per one you skin. So you should be hitting that level 100 skinning really rather quickly. This is then going to lead you over to Restless Shore and from there you're going to be traveling to Boar's Hole, a land that is honestly filled with more boars than it is actually possible to imagine. And due to the fact that there are normally a really good number of players sort of running there, they have an absolutely insane respawn time. In short, you can basically endlessly skin high level boars without any need to stop. When I was there it did pretty much descend into just sort of a free for all so people are going to nick and skin your kills. In the end I just sort of decided that if you can't beat them join them and I just joined in and started skinning as fast as I can. It only took me just over an hour to go from skinning level 100 all the way up to maxing it out at skinning level 200. I even made the stupid mistake at the start of having an iron skinning knife. I'm not quite sure why I hadn't upgraded that before, but something that I soon rectified and upgraded to the star metal one to take me to 200, because that skins so much faster. And yeah, you should be able to get to 200 really quite quickly. You'll end up with an enormous amount of thick hide, which kind of due to this current working at Boar's Hole, is absolutely worthless because there's far more of it than rawhide currently available, so that has kind of affected the market somewhat. And fundamentally, that's really all there is to it. Skinning is currently the easiest gathering trade skill to level, and you really can go from 0 to 200 in just a few hours. I do wonder if Amazon may eventually reduce the respawn rate at Borsholm, since skinning leveling there is just so ridiculously fast. So it may be worth getting this done sooner rather than later. But anyway, that's all we've got time for in this video. If you've got any questions about skinning, the areas or leveling, then do ask them in the comments down below and I'll get back to you. Of course subscribe to the channel for lots more New World content and I shall see you guys all on the next video.